Hello everybody, this is your managing broker David Bovin with Kale Realty here. I just wanted to give you a uh, rundown on how to set up a search in the MLS for your client that is savable. So the first thing you're going to do is click on the search tab. You're going to choose the property type that you're interested in. Choose the statuses that you're interested in. You can just choose an area, so if you have someone that specifically wants a particular suburb or an area of the city, you can enter that in. Personally, most of my clients come to me and say, I need to be within this uh, radius of where I work, or this is the area that I want to be in within a couple of miles. So what you're going to do is you're going to click here to select boundaries under map search, center on the location that you're most interested in. So it could be their work address, or it could be where they currently live, whatever they suggest. And you have the option to either put a square in that area for you know a particular uh, range. You can draw yourself a line, so like a uh, polygon here, wherever you'd like to go. And the one that I use the most is this uh, circle. So you can draw a radius around your center point for as many miles as you'd like. Click OK, put in your parameters, whatever those might be. If there's something that you cannot find within your parameters, you can click on the right here, Add Remove Fields, and you literally have every single parameter within the MLS to choose from. So if someone specifically has to have a basement bathroom, select it, click over, click OK and now you have the ability to say yes it has to have a basement bathroom there are a million different things you can do with it alright but um, the first step you want to do is click count and see how many searches come up so in my personal opinion 93 results is too many for you to send to one client so then you can break it down a little bit um, the first thing that will make it easiest is bedroom so if you have a minimum and a max that's great. Then you could do baths. After that, um, pretty much everything else is going to really, really tighten up your search. So see what comes up here. Now we have 28, which is fairly reasonable. So at this point, what I would do is I would click Save Search, title your search, add your client, choose their type and the automatic search is set up to go out daily in the morning you can change that up if you want it to be every two days you would click here three days click here and so on um, you can also select the time the morning is typically best because then they get everything that's fresh right when they start looking first thing you know when they check their email for the day once you click save this will be uh, sent to your client all 29 of those properties in addition, what's going to happen is anytime a new property comes up within those parameters, they will get an email for the next six to eight weeks. Um, you can choose how long you want that to go for, but it's a great tool so that you don't have to continue to find properties every day for people to view. They see what's new within their parameters and they click interested or not interested. If you have any other questions or need additional training, please shoot me an email, david at kalerealty.com. Thanks.